okay people will ask you types of script includes okay and answers if you see there are so many multiple answers you see in community there is no separate concept called types of script include as per documentation of service now okay if you just go to docs.servicenow.com open the script include concept you don't see separate thing called script include types okay maybe as per my knowledge but let's try one more time from your end and if you find it now we will review it okay so now if you get this kind of question now how you can answer is okay maybe one answer is uh, okay server callable client callable okay in script include page there is something called client callable okay where is that this one okay if you check this one it is client callable if you don't check it means server callable okay so if it is client callable then only it will support okay the ajax call if it is not checked means it cannot be called from ajax is that clear ma yes one more time please one more time please so <laughs> how you can call a script include from a client side using ajax right so when a, when a script include is supporting the ajax call that means it is checked with this option if it is unchecked maybe it won't support the ajax call client callable thank you right so this is one way of seeing the answer this is true but if i say that one the mad guy interviewer will say no this is not the one maybe i want the other answer Okay. The other way of seeing the same answer is okay. Script include with one function or multiple functions. Okay, when you have a script include and with one function, na you can directly call the function. You no need to pass pa util. You can directly call the function. It will work. So that way, if you see one function, one scripting, that is one type. If one script include with multiple function, that is another type. Okay, ma. This is the second way of seeing the definition types. One way is this one. Second way is this one. But it is actually not the concept at all. If you logically think that this is a relevant question, but if you face this kind of questions, try to answer like this. Clear, ma. Maybe some name is there, ma. Uh, script include with one function is like there is a word maybe in community you can see it okay let me get that link so that it helps us okay so this is one more question important question maybe you can just go through it and coming to script include i think that's that is that's it ma what is script include okay one small thing we will discuss that is very very important okay that is also one more important for okay just give me one second so see here uh, on demand extend classes define a new class so this is one way of so on demand means script include with one okay one function extend i don't know what it is so uh, class pattern so everyone are defining their own own types ma. these are all types i don't know what are them okay so script include with one class okay this is one way of seeing it client callable okay this is another way of seeing it i don't know on demand okay but keep this thread just read it and it will be more confusing okay if it is more confusing stick to with these two if you are able to understand maybe good you take and you can take your own notes what is saying classless because if a uh, script include is a class right yeah. why, why is the saying classless classless means one function that is the meaning of classless that's why i said no, it is it is more confusing okay thanks yeah so see they are saying class less right but still what is this first line itself is a class now script include itself is a class why can they Correct. say class less right mm -hmm. so it is okay. meaningless ma this this concept is meaningless but still for interview purpose i'm just covering it i don't want to confuse you more but yeah thank you thank you right 